at first. High and deep to left. And that is going to leave the ballpark. Arkansas takes the lead on Ezel's fourth home run of the season on a 1-2 pitch. Yeah, he left it up. And credit Ezel. He's had a pretty good day battling and got a pitch to hit and hit it out of the park to give them the two-run lead. That's and a no-doubter. That yeah. is a no-doubter. And he snuck one by him, the pitch before at 87, a dangerous pitch, and really kind of went to the same location. Ezel made him play. Skipper's got to hold it right there. Tyler Jones kind of settled down right here. He's given up a couple long fly balls, but that's all they've been is long fly balls. Here's another one in the air to right. This might have enough, and it's gone. Woo, pig suey. Ezel in his second at bat as a Razorback. Clubs a home run to start the scoring in 2019. Transfer that can really swing the bat, really compact. He got all that one. He hit it to the right part of the park. Yeah, he really did. You know, he's, again, we talked about his frame. Goes about five foot eight, 200 pounds. Got a lot of pop in that swing. And it's near the bottom of the fifth. Smoke to left center. And it's going to play two more. Kerstad goes to third. What in the world is the throw going to home? And it lets Ezel take second. That's a bad throw right there. Missing the cutoff. Man. Oh, yeah. For the Panthers. Keeps loose in his hat. Ezel will smoke one to left, and that one locked up Kerrigan, and he took a bounce off his chest. Ezel's going to try for two. The throw is there in time, but Ezel jumped over the tag. That's an outstanding. <laughs> a little, little love pat right there. To take him. second after this ball took a chunk out of Kerrigan, but let's watch the slide attempt here at the end. He kind of locked up, and yeah, he jumped right over that tag. You can see. Look at my chops right here. Infield in, 2-0, and he whacks one into the gap. Right center, that's down for a long base hit. Martin walks home to score as the ball runs all the way to the wall. He's out thinking three. The relay is late. Skips by. And planks off the hogs dugout. Trevor Ezel with a triple, and it's 2-0 Arkansas. Like this. Not a bad get as Ezel lines one up the middle. It's a base hit near the gap. First down around second base. Nate Thompson holds him there. And Ezel comes through. Now the ball gets away. He'll take second base. Heads up play by Trevor Ezel. Second and third. Two outs. Hogs threatening here in the seventh. He, did he swings and it's one high and deep out to right center. Wilson running out of real estate. It is gone. A two run blast by Trevor Ezel. And just like that, it is a nine three ball game. I'm going to lose the specs because you got to find that ball. That one might be found on the other side of the fence. Back to the wall. Goodbye. Trevor Ezell just keeps on swinging it. And the Hogs have a 3 nothing lead. Off the bat, you knew that ball was juiced. You knew that the wind was blowing in, but sometimes you can just hit him through the wind, and Ezell knew he got that one. Remember, he just missed one in the first. It went back to the fence and right where Ezell to deep center. Still carrying and off the wall. Kerstad gets the wave. Scores. Now Ezell takes it to third. RBI double makes it 6 0 Arkansas. He'll take that to left center field. And all the way to third, Kerstad has the green light. The throw over shoots everybody at second. And an in for a stand-up double, Trevor Ezel. It's just how it is. They're, they're good hitters. Here now, Trevor Ezel gives this one a long ride to the wall in left center field. He's in the second base. Green light, meanwhile, out for Kerstad. And with that bad ankle and all, he'll come in. The throw to the plate is high. It'll be a double and then the advancement on the throw. And Arkansas has taken a 5-2 to two lead. They're going to... Uh, Auburn's first yeah. base coach are also talking. Up the middle. Throw to first. Out at first, and the runner gets to third. What a really, really nice play over there at first base. The big guys. Back to back. Handled the bat very well. 
Bliss, oh, and a nice play at first by Ezel. Ezel into deep center field. Howell goes back, he looks up, and it's gone. A three-run homer for Ezel. Apparently the power potential is pretty good for both sides of the play for yep. Ezel. What a player he is. What a player Trevor Ezel is. And that will be all for Richard Fitz. What a great job offensively by Arkansas. They have a big lead here in the fifth inning. And they have gotten into the Auburn bullpen. And not a terrible job by Fitz. He needs a little offensive help. Had some walks that hurt him in the big blow there by Ezel. Batting practice, and he just carried it over into the ball game with a big hit. Ezel will smoke one in the gap. This ball is down. It's going to go to the track. Washington Jr. scores easily on a double from Ezel. And it's an 8-6 Arkansas lead. Batting average, homered five times and knocked in 23. Right away, a fly ball to deep left. And off the wall. Played back into the infield by Scott, a leadoff double for Ezel. Hit the ball, and if you have the data to back it up, might as well play there. Slapped out to left. We'll get down, and this will be extra bases again for Ezel. The run scores to make it 3-1. to one. Ezel in at second. Ezel, right side. We'll get Arkansas back to the lead. Ball gets loose, and Ezel goes to second. Two RBI single, eight to seven Razorbacks. For another one of these talented sophomores on this team, a slow dribbler to Martin. He will charge, scoop, and throw, and Ezel had to come off the bag to apply the tag on Foscu. Franklin runs. Is this ball going to stay fair? Yes, Ezel with the base hit. Franklin never stopped. He's going to score from first easily. Oh, what a perfect hit and run right there. Ezel hits a line drive to right. That's going to go. It clears the fence. And the Razorbacks have taken the lead. Well, that's one thing that happens when you throw 100 miles an hour. The ball comes in in a hurry and it leaves in a hurry. That ball was smoked by Trevor Ezell. Now he's just two hits shy away from 300. Five seen out of Ezell in a long time. Boy, he got the head out and you knew with the velocity of the pitch, it just created the power. Didn't get out by a lot, but boy, it was a line shot. He's pumped up. Get out of him. He's a pretty mild-mannered guy. And there is career hit number 300 for Trevor Ezell. Coming off a three-hit game last night, that is one big round number for Trevor Ezell. Warren let that, let his talent come through. That bun is a dandy. Lipsius has no play. Everybody's safe, and there's runners on the corner. Breaking ball, drill to left center field. Charleston back, it's over his head. Kicks up off the fence. That might give Franklin a chance to score. He'll be waved in and is safe at the plates. A two-run double from Trevor Ezell, and it's jumped the lead to 6-0. Saw Zach Barr sitting next to Coach Hobbs. Come back to that in a second. Nesbitt will have a tough play. Ezell with the scoop. Took the hard bounce and gets the out and lifts the sweeps of Eastern Illinois and Stony Brook. There's that contact we talked about, Ryan Shin on the run. He'll play that off the wall and it takes an Arkansas hop. Ezell gets a good look, but he'll remain at second base with a leadoff double. Hammered into the corner. Ezell will make the turn easily as Shin comes up throwing, but that's a double now for Ezell, his 15th of the year. Turnover rocks to find pitchers to fill out the rotation. Wow, a moonshot from Ezell, and that is long gone. Ezell picked this pitch up quickly, opened the hips up, saw it, cleared it, and there was no doubt about this one. One hopper, what a pick by Casey Martin. Yes, oh sir, what a pick. and over at first to help him out, it's Trevor Ezell. 
Oh, wow. Huh. That's a few oh wows. And that does deserve a tip of the cap right there. Payoff. Ripped high and deep to left field. If it's fair, it's way gone. It is both a three run shot for Trevor Ezell. And Arkansas slugs its way to a third inning lead. All speed pitch for a strike. He tried to challenge him, stayed right out over the plate. And Ezell knew it as soon as he hit it. With one swing of the bat, second time around the lineup. Down the line at fair. Trevor Ezell has his second hit of the night. This one's going to go for extra bases. He thought about a triple. And now still no, thinking no, no. about Ooh. an extra 90 and almost. You get the classic no doubles defense. Scorch to right field. Base hit for Ezell. His first of the game. And with one out here in the fifth. Back to oh. Omaha. A little number. Runner's going to score from third. Tough throw to first base. Safe. Everybody safe. The ball went 20 feet. That was a great read by Nesbitt at third base. That one's back to left field, and that is gone. Oh, did we get a hold of that? That ball was crushed. Ezo got a pitch up, and typically right-handed hitters can handle the pitch up, and that is right around the letters. Watch the top hand. Goes right to the ball. Direct to the ball. Through the ball, that full extension, he knew it as soon as he hit it. We'll do the 3-2 pitch again. Headed to left field. Diving stop. Checker to throw, not in time. As Trevor Ezell beats it out for a hit. So it's on. One for two in the game. Toward left center field and deep. Ball still in play. And Ezell with a stand-up double. It was a great effort in center field. But Arkansas has the lead man aboard here in the fifth. Two to Trevor Ezell with a man at second. And in a right field. It's going to make it 3 nothing. He's out around first, headed in a second. He will stand up. Three nothing. The Hogs. Well, this is just a great at bat by Trevor Ezel as he gets a breaking ball, what looked to be out over the outside part of the plate. Didn't make contact yet. This time he did though. Base hit left field, one out in the fifth, hit number eight. Can't keep a good hitter down. No Ezel sir. Gets a fastball in, and he keeps his hands inside and shoots this to left. 3-2 pitch, line drive down the line. That's going to be extra bases for Ezell. And the Hogs are in business here in the bottom of the first inning. First after reaching out an error, the first of the game for either team. This one is hit hard toward the gap by Ezell. That's going to get down, bang off the wall. Franklin motors into third. He'll hold there. Second double for Trevor Ezell. Change for the Rebels at the plate. And start getting some outs, but they're not here. Another home run for Arkansas, and it's the 10th of the year for Ezell. It's 10-1. to 1. Arkansas knows they're going to get predominantly fastballs from Tyler Myers. He's, he's accurate around the plate, but that's because he throws a lot of fastballs. And Trevor Ezell low and in a no-no to a left-handed hitter and goes down and gets it. That's four at bats in a row that Trevor Ezell at the leadoff spot has barreled it up and that ball is crushed to right. That's down and raked into right field base hit. One run is in. Two run score. Trevor Ezell continues to slam the ball around the ballpark here in Fayetteville during the Super Regional. Second run. And this one is ripped to right. Franklin is going to be stopped by Nate Thompson at third base. Another hit for Ezell. He's got six now in the Super Regional. Who had been so effective against Arkansas in his three prior appearances against the Razorbacks. 
He's going to be safe. Trevor Ezell, good speed, beats it out. It's a very good stadium, but they've added so many things. Backhand Ezell. Oh, my, what a play. Double play! Trevor Ezell, that's why he was all SEC defensive team. Starts a 3-6-1.